Hi and thank you for watching this quick tutorial on installing Chartmaker for live code. You've downloaded the file, you've got a zip file, it's sat on the desktop, now what? Well the first thing to do is extract it so that the source files can be installed. Where do we install them? Well it's true for Macs as well as Windows. You go to your account, there's mine, and you're now looking for a folder called My Live Code. If one doesn't exist, and it doesn't here, we have to create one. So, quickly create a new folder called My Live Code. In that folder, we create another folder called Plugins. And we now drop files that we've downloaded, the plugins that we want to have available to live code, we simply select them and move them into that folder there. Now, the next time I open live code down here, they should all be listed under the development menu, under plugins, and there they all are. Chartmaker itself, this is the library. Really, you don't need to access this at all. It's all interactively available when you do your coding or when you use the utility. The playgrounds are all unlocked samples so that you can investigate and see some coding if you want to. First job though will be to look at the utility and that will be what I look at next for you. Thanks very much indeed for, for watching. Bye bye.